Here's your news on the go this morning. SUNY Oswego is not scheduled to shut down or switch to virtual learning despite having more than 100 positive COVID-19 cases since the start of the semester. New York State clarifying that the governor's 100 case shutdown threshold applies to specific two-week windows, not the last 14 days. The first window closed on Friday when the school had 82 cases, the second opening yesterday starting off with 31 cases. And another SUNY school dealing with a potentially viral issue, SUNY Brockport suspending its wrestling program after one of its members came into contact with a coronavirus case. The college president says the team was not respecting distancing and masking policies and that risky behavior will not go unchallenged. 50 people were put into quarantine until their tests come back negative. A fire at the popular Arid Evans Inn in Fayetteville forcing the restaurant to close its doors for up to six months. The call coming in yesterday afternoon, firefighters cutting the roof open above the kitchen in order to reach the flames. The fire caused heavy damage in the kitchen and private dining room upstairs. The restaurant posting to Facebook that the roof was under construction at the time. In Oneida County, Rome police are investigating gunshots at an area bar. The call coming in just before midnight. Officers heading to the Ramblin' Inn on North James Street in Rome. The suspect had already left the scene. Police confirming shots were fired. No one was hurt in that incident. The investigation is ongoing. If you have any information, give Rome police a call at 315-838-1902.